All right, today we're going to go over the trig scales, specifically the tangent scale. And T is right up top. We also have second T, and that's a different scale if you're going from 0.01 to 1. If you look down at the other end, the blue scale is 0.01 to 0.1. So where does T start? It starts at 5.7, just like the other ones. And if we go all the way down, we'll see that it goes from 0.57 to 45 degrees. If we were to go to tangent of 25 degrees, the blue numbers is gonna be 0.1 to one. So that means if we're at 25 degrees on tangent, down below on D, we're gonna be at 0.465 instead of 4.65. Now, when you're reading the tangent reverse scale, that one from 45 to 90, you can't just read down on the D scale like you would normally. Some slide rules have a DI scale, and that's a D inverted scale. And that's what you would want to use because you're going to use the cotangent instead of the tangent on that scale. But we don't have a DI scale. But what do we have? So if we think this through, what's the same as a D scale? It's going to be a C scale. And we do have a CI scale on this slide rule. So it's not gonna be 3.64, we need to do the CI scale. So if we flip over, we're gonna be at 2.74. Tangent 70 equals 2.74. Now, if you notice on the tangent scale, it goes from 45 to a little bit before 85. Well, that's where our second tangent scale comes down below it. If we were to look over here, it goes in reverse. We're back around 84. And it just picks up those red numbers at 85, 86. And if we go all the way down to the end, it's going to basically get us to 90, a little bit underneath. But that's the tangent scale. That's just a basic overview of how it's laid out.